Hello YouTube and welcome to another Pokemon X and Y Wi-Fi battle. This is another passerby challenge uh, with Juan this time. Juan has Absol, who's probably Mega, Victini, Shyman, Nidoking, Minchao, and Azelf. And I'm still winning my first Ivy Bread team of Mamoswine, Registeel, Gengar, Mega Alakazam, Gyarados, and Tyranitar. Um, this is my first battle against most of his Pokemon. Um, I think... Yeah, I don't actually, I don't think I've ever come up against any of them, and I've only ever used the Nidoking, so a lot of things I won't be familiar with. Let's see how it goes for me. Alright, so looking at his team, a lot of people really like to lead with Azelf. Um, if they're using an Azelf, it's, it's a good lead, it's fast, you know, it can U-turn, it can do some other crazy stuff, but stealth rocks and whatnot. Um, so let's see. Yeah, so I did predict that and lead with the Tyranitar. And he goes for the taunt, expecting me to set up rocks. But this Tyranitar is actually a salt vest. And I just go straight for the crunch and takes Azelf to a sash. And then Sandstorm kills it. So 6 5, me. Here comes Mian Chao. Mian Chao, I don't know how to say that. I think Mian Chao. Goes for the high jump kick. I thought that was too obvious, so I didn't switch to Gengar. I'm like, oh, come on, there's no way. I, I have a Gengar sitting here on my team, but... Anyways, turns out he is... We will find out later. He is choiced. Um, but predicting he very well could be choiced. He didn't take life orb damage. Probably choiced then. I send out Gengar. He has to switch out to Victini. And I go for the Shadow Ball on the incoming Victini and take that out. So, it is now 5-4 um, me. Take a little bit from the um, the Sandstorm. Here comes Absol. I run away from that real quick. I'm expecting probably, I think they're only like Dark Move they like is Sucker Punch. So, might be safe. And I switch out to Registeel. Now, I know they can have, I think, only via transfer, they can have superpower. Um, but I decide that, you know, he's obviously not going for superpower when I had um, Gengar, and so it was safe to switch in Registeel. So now I use Protect to see if he had anything for me, and he has the Fire Blast. I'm like, oh, Fire Blast, I can take that. He actually misses when I don't Protect. I get a Charge Beam off. Doesn't do much, and don't get the 70% chance to raise my special attack. Goes for Fire Blast. It does nothing at all. I mean, he doesn't have great special attack to begin with, but... So, Charge Beam, and I do get a special attack raise here. And then some leftovers. Now, Protect again. I want to just keep, you know, moving up as much as I can, and then, you know, Charge Beaming every other turn. He actually has superpower though, so he does reveal that on my Protect. So I'm like, okay, time to get out of here. So I swap out for Gengar, and he put or he does, okay, he superpowers. He's faster though, and has knockoff. This guy just, one, everything can get knockoff, but this guy just has all of those new tutor moves. So I send out Registeel again, and he actually switches out for Nidoking. And for some reason, I guess I predicted that, that and went for the Flash Cannon. I'm like, well, you know, he should have just went for Superpower, but okay. Now I switch out against the Nidoking. Like, he's gonna go for Earth Power, of course. So I send in my Gyarados. predicted correctly. Then I switch I switch out again. They often carry Thunderbolt. I'm hoping they do. I send out my Mamoswine. But no. And it goes for Ice Man, Which would have been on Gyarados. So I'm like, ugh. Well, Ice Shard for a little damage. Doesn't KO it, but almost does. And another Ice Beam. There goes Mamoswine. But I'm like, okay. 
probably doesn't have Thunderbolt. Oh, no, never mind. I don't think that might. So, I send him out like a Zam, he withdraws. For the Absol. And I will go Mega. Copy his magic bounce. Awesome. And Shadow Ball. It doesn't take Absol out yet. Gotta switch out because you know that Sucker Punch is coming. In comes Registeel. Yeah, Sucker Punch. I get healed some. He goes for the superpower now. And I tank it. Registeel. I love the Reggie Pokemon. Well, except for Reggie Gigas, but. So I went for the attack. I KO'd the Absol. So back out comes Nidoking. I protect, get a little HP back. From the leftovers there. And Earth Power is still going to be enough. So now Alex Sam is in. Have the sheer force now. So Shadow Ball and so Shadow Ball gets a boost from that. Psy Shock doesn't have a secondary effect. Um, Focus Blast I don't think can lower anything. And can, can Dazzling Gleam? I don't know. But anyways, here's where I see he's scarfed. But because you can't knock off a Mega Stone. I don't take much from the, you know, I don't get KO'd from knockoff. So I still defeat them, uh, Mian Shao. Then in comes Shaman. And I know nothing about that other than, you know, it's all hundreds, but... Psy Shock doesn't do anything, it's defensive. Earth Power KO's Alakazam, I'm like, uh-oh. So I have... I think it's, I think it's 1v1 now, I think I just have Gyarados. And he has Life Orb, so he's down, you know, well below half. Like, Ice Fang should do it. Can, I just need to know, can I take a hit? So he Seed Flares. An intimidating looking move, but I do survive. He loses more HP. Ice Fang, I don't miss. That's going to be a dead Shaman, and I win the battle. Um, so, good battle. Um, like, comment, subscribe, let me know. If there's any Pokemon you want me to train, leave your friend codes and we can have a battle. Um, yeah, this will probably be my last video today, but I do have eight more coming up soon.